Reportedly, the Indian Navy has today successfully test fired the K-4 submarine launch ballistic missile from INS Arighat, an upgraded variant of the Arihant class submarine. The missile has a range of 3,500 kilometers. This is the eighth test of the missile. The K-4, when fired from the Bay of Bengal, has most of China in its reach. Submarine launch ballistic missiles are said to be the most critical part of the nuclear triad. A nuclear triad involves nuclear attack capability from launch platforms based on land, sea and air. Nuclear triads eliminate an enemy's ability to destroy a nation's nuclear force in a first strike attack. This gives the country an ability to launch a second strike and hence enhances its nuclear deterrence. Unlike land and air-based nuclear weapons launch platforms, which will be the primary targets of any attacker, as the platforms can be easily located, it is nearly impossible to track a submarine launch platform lurking in the depths of the sea. Apart from India, only seven other nations have the ability to fire a ballistic missile from submarine lurking in the deep blue sea. Besides the K-4, the Indian Navy operates the K-15 ballistic missile, which is said to have a much shorter range of 750 kilometers. India is also working on missiles with a much longer range such as the 5000 km range K5 and the 8000 km range K6 missiles. The K6 is slated to have the multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle or MIRV capability. This means that a single missile will be able to carry multiple warheads, making it virtually impossible for any adversary to protect against this threat.